alam naman ang lahat ng tao na si Nino Yakino had a pact, an unholy alliance with uh, the Malaysians uh, to drop the claim of Sabah. He was very emphatic. At kapal nga ng mukha eh. Na-announce pa. Napagka siya ron naging presidente, na-drop niya yung claim sa, sa Sabah. Oo. Oh. Uh, yung Saba, ano? Well, uh, mabuti na bibigyan ng uh, karapat dapat na ng atensyon dito, ano? At uh, ina, ina, tinataas, inaangat na po ni Secretary Loxin yung pagbibigay ng atensyon dito. At sabi niya, ito ay dadalhin niya at mapakusapan sa BIMP Iyaga uh, itong Philippine Claims over Saba uh, to be discussed by BIMP Iyaga. Sabi ko nga sa iyo kanina, alam na alam mo itong BIMP Iyaga nasa plano mo nga doon Belt and Road na doon dapat idaan uh, in uh, the Philippine participation. So uh, sabi dito ni Loxin, the Philippines claim over Sabah should not have been allowed to go dormant and the issue was expected to be taken up by regional peers. Mainis na naman ang Malaysia dito dahil nandun sila, nakaupo din sila dyan. Uh, Foreign Secretary Teodoro Teddy Boy Loxin Jr. said Tuesday. Kaado, ikaw ang uh, familiar sa BIMP Iyaga. Yeah, I launched an advocacy in year 2012 and I entitled it Bangsa Sulok Rising. And I have an unpublished book on this precisely because yung last chapter, which uh, the revival of the claim, uh, eh hinihintay ko because that would be my last chapter for the book. But the book is ready uh, without uh, a chapter or two. Ang uh, problema kasi dito, eh, nabili ng mga intereses na banyaga at mga in cahoots with our oligarchy. Unang-una na yung Aquino, kuwang ko oligarchy na yan. Alam naman ang lahat ng tao na si Nino Aquino had a pact, an unholy alliance with uh, the Malaysians uh, to drop the claim of Sabah. He was very emphatic. At kapal nga ng mukha eh. Na-announce pa. Napagka siya ron naging presidente, na-drop niya yung claim sa, sa Sabah. Oh. Eh, anyway, alam mo, Kamento, na-button hole tayo rito ng, ano eh, ng uh, British by insisting on the technicality of whether the Tausug word Pajak meant session in favor of Malaysia or lease in favor of the Philippines. Uh, now, hindi naman na namin mention that in the same contract there is a prohibition for the, uh, 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 for the British company uh, which was a private company it had no authority no right whatsoever to acquire anything Huh? on the basis of sovereignty. No? Ownership siguro meron. Pero sovereignty, ibang issue yan. Now, there is a portion of that pinirmahan na yan na hindi pwedeng i-turn over ang whatever rights, lease rights na yan that uh, the British company acquired to any country, state, or nation. Oh. Tambotong hole tayo rin sa lease or session. Now, if you read the, uh, I, I would advise our listeners to read the uh, arguments of none other than Jovito Salonga, ang pinaka-brilliant points of our Sabah claim was initiated by Jovito Salonga, the late great senator, uh, Jovito Salonga. And uh, isa sa mga issue na binanggit niya dyan uh, is that there is no question whatsoever on the ownership of the Sultanate of Sulu over Sabah. What is at question is the involvement of a overdeck and dent which was the brim, which was the Borneo uh, British North Borneo Company, no? 
uh, acquiring some kind of rights. They cannot have rights over sovereignty because they're not a country. They're a private individual. The public power of acquisition and administration of North Borneo, unlike the British trading companies chartered at that time, does not extend. So, ang malabo, yung acquisition ng British North Borneo Company, ipso facto, the British, and ipso facto, the Malaysians. Yung acquisition ng Sultanate of Sulu has no question okay. whatsoever. Okay, we, I think it's very clear we have the right uh, to Sabah, the Philippines, no? Number one, first point. Second point, I also, uh, and maybe you should mention this also in your discussion lagi, uh, Malaysia conducted a referendum that is not uh, genuine, ano? Yung referendum importante, hindi mo nababanggit yan. Pwede yung referendum self-determination. Uh, but that's what they present to the UN. Eh. That's why we have to keep repeating that it's a fake. Ah. Number three, assuming that we are successful in bringing it up again to the UN, we cannot go to war. We cannot force, or can we get the UN to enforce something? Yun ang tanong sa iyo. Well, I would look at this with two hands. One mm. is the the public of the Philippines had over diplomacy. But there is no stopping, even in Islamic law, for the Sultanate of Sulu and the Tausuk nation from declaring or recovering land which is their own. And in Islam, which the Malaysians understand, they have a right to a uh, 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 what do you call this? Uh, I, I'm the Kumasabi word right now, eh? Uh, but it's uh, I don't have a dog. Oh, I'm going to go to the other side. I'm going to go My point is, but the Malaysians will not give it up without a fight. Meron bang middle ground without fighting, but with, of course, pressure na may makuha ang Pilipinas at ang Sultanate of Sulu. Well, I am, I am private to the strategies of the Sultanate of Sulu because I'm a consultant to uh, Sultan Pugdalun Kiram II. And I cannot, uh, I, I, cannot, cannot I cannot speak any further. Okay, all, I, all I can say is the Sultanate of Sulu is not bound because the Sultanate of Sulu is a de facto state. It, it has the option to obey the Constitution of the Philippines or to seek recovery of a lost territory grabbed from them under Islamic law. Oh, so okay. that's all I will say. Okay, and uh, may army pa naman ang oh, the, word, the, word, <laughs> the word I was uh, looking for was jihad. Jihad, oh. Eh, alam na natin, ibig sabihin ng jihad. Okay, okay. so... Oh, yeah. uh, okay. So let me read some of our uh, uh, some of our uh, listeners and the audience po, no? From Angel Aliporo heard about 12th of the nations hosted by Ka Anton Israel common please. I have not heard uh, and I promise to review that, no? So sige, uh, we will take a look, ano? Uh, Kaado baka meron ka na nakita na tungkol kay uh, Anton Israel. Wala pa rin siguro, no? We've never discussed it. From Archie Cruz, good evening, Kamento and Kado, no? God bless you both. Rain Cloud, good evening, Kamento and Kado from Daegu. Daegu is in Korea ba? Uh, I would think so, no? From June Locilliano, good evening, Kamento and Kado. Lagi akong nakasunod sa inyo watching from Pawai, Ilocos, Norte. And uh, if I had time, I would sing Pamulina when for you. Saldi Oreo, yung mga asymptomatic lang nabubuhay pag nagkataon. Laughing out loud. Ayan about Saba claim, kamentong kada. Pwede bang iakyat sa international court itong claim na to? Pwedeng pwede po. Ano? Uh, ang mag magiging depensa ng Malaysia lagi yung kanilang referendum. So there has to be a way to uh, topple uh, that uh, uh, myth, myth about that uh, referendum. Kasi wala namang representative uh, parties dyan, eh, no? Rain cloud, 40% of Malaysian wealth are coming from Sabah. You're correct. 
kita po ninyo yung mapa na ginawa ko po ano Malaysia nasa mapa eh when it should be the Philippines no and uh, uh, si Gato Serizal bumibisita po uh, sa Sandakan which is in Sabah ano and uh, parang parte ng Pilipinas talaga yon noon panahon niya eh ano uh, from John Paul de los Reyes uh, Salamat po commentong engkado sa pagtatalakay tungkol sa usapin sa Saba. Ano? Balikan po, I really love that part of the result story na nung nasa dapitan siya, ano, and napunta siya sa Sandakan and, and so on. Uh, John, John uh, from Saldi Oreo, Malaysia has the same military, military power to the Philippines but we are greater in numbers precisely. That's the advantage of having a big population. Ken Fernandez, good evening po. Po, and from Rex Lumhod, good evening Kado and Kamento. Sa Facebook, may bago bang pumasok from uh, Florence Ecknerolf. Na Nalit ako, at least nakahabol. Gandang gabi, mga sir from Singapore po. Ano, Dan Malyari, ba't umalis nyo, uh, umalis nyo ang topic kay Lugaw? Mamaya, babalik po tayo dyan. Ano? And from uh, Felipe Cruz, uh, let's see, Seymour. Uh, good evening sa inyo. Comment on Kaada. We are in listening and watching regularly. Thank you for your tireless service to accurate and truthful, useful information. More power to, pro for to your program from uh, Carlos Anyago. Good evening po. Comment on Kaada. Keep safe always. Palagay ko po. Mahirapan na tayong mabawi ang saba. Well, yung creative approach po dito ang importante and uh, political will which the Sultanate of Sulu uh, clearly has, ano, and now with President Duterte, eh, at least uh, nabuhay na ulit itong issue na to.